It's late. Where have you been? The case. Working on the case. What? What have you been doing all day? Missing you. How's the case? Good. We've got some strong evidence, but I think we'll get a decision tomorrow. Damn, you smell good. Thanks, hon. You're sweet, but I was thinking I'd go take a shower. Huh. Okay. Whatever. Hey, Judy, can we talk? How's it coming along? So do you want to hear the truth or the lie? Are you still sleeping with him? Chris, he's my husband. Are you still having sex with him? Chris! You do or you don't? Chris, please don't talk to me like that. Please give me a proper answer then. I've got the papers. They're ready to file. Just need to tell the man. Well, tell the man. I'm tired of sharing someone I love with somebody else. You don't know how hard this is. You're not the married one. Oh my God, it's been years. How the heck have you been? Not bad at all, man. How's time been treating you? Very well, thank you. Uh, what brings you in here? Oh, uh, this is a client of mine, Doris. I want you to meet an old student of mine, Chris. Hi, Doris, it's very nice to meet you. Very nice to meet you, too. Yeah, I was just here for uh, a little business. I, I, I've actually got a, a card here. Directing now? Yeah, art and money, baby. How about yourself? Lawyer. Man, for God's sake. You know, I actually know a lady who needs a lawyer. Have her give me a call? I definitely will. You handle divorce cases, right? Divorces? Easy stuff. Simple. All right, that's good to know. Well, look, I, I have to run. Take care of some stuff. He's actually an old college professor of mine. We, you know, we were pretty close back then. He's a good lawyer. What's wrong? Do you remember what I told you about my husband? 
Yeah, of course, but you're not going to have him handle this, are you? <sighs> this cannot be happening. Oh, really? Because that's the worst excuse that I've ever heard. It's not an excuse. And what I mean okay, by, gotcha. will you let me finish? I'm pretty sure he'll say yes if I ask him for a divorce. What are you concerned about then? We've been married for almost 15 years, and if I just walk out on her, she's going to be living like a widow. Well, if she's not living like a widow, then I'm living like your bitch. I don't want him to think I'm a bitch after the divorce. All she knows is how to be my wife. She doesn't even have any friends of her own. He's going to be totally humiliated in front of his friends. They knew how much he loved me. She's going to hate me after this. I don't want her to hate me. Okay, look, I... I didn't really want to bring this up right now, but it seems like I don't really have a choice. Choice about what? I'm pregnant. thinking what do you think I'm thinking you'd like to try the chicken sure why not Guess what a small world it is. Pretty small, I guess. I ran into one of my old college students today. And? And he's a director now and actually said he's got a client for me. Would you like some coffee? Sure, why not? What else did he tell you? That's it. Did he tell you who the client is? No, but I gave him my card. They should call. Sounds like a nice guy. Yeah, he uh, was always a super student, super intelligent, super loud, just super. You know, why don't you finish up that coffee? I was just thinking maybe the two of us could go upstairs.
All right, so he comes home. She falls down the stairs, dies, right? He finds her, takes a bunch of these, freaks out, kills himself. Gotta be. Look how happy they looked. Yeah, they sure did. Mm -hmm.